it No gunshots, but they getting Hey, what's up you guys? It's Craft Farms here, back again with another video. And today we are still hard at the soybean harvest. We are now combining field 11 uh, here currently. Got the Lexion, he's working on his headlands. Uh, he's on the first one right now. <coughs> uh, we got the grain cart sitting here. Uh, ready to rock and roll once the combine uh, needs to unload. We got the truck sitting here. Uh, and let's see let's check how full this bin is should be just about full yep 82 percent so one more truckload and we will be ready to rock and roll uh, onto the next bin uh, this field's yielding pretty well as well uh, 13 over there uh, that didn't do so well um, that field right there that didn't do that great uh, that little fort field 14 right there that actually uh, yielded way more soybeans than field 13 did and it's like half of its size um, so let's run over here um, yeah so this field here this yielded way better than uh, the field over here did so we don't have five bins full like we like I was hoping we would but uh, we're getting enough grain so we'll be sitting pretty well uh, ah good there. I'm actually going to stop this guy because of these trees here uh, the grain cart will end up getting stuck in them I probably should have removed the clip from those as well, but I never did. Um, show you guys here in just a moment. Oh, I guess I really don't have any pictures. Um, me and another guy, we are going to be working on making a pickup header soon. Uh, if you guys saw, I think I showed it in Tuesday's video, or some other video that uh, I was going to make a Macdon PW8 pickup header well uh, a buddy of mine he had already started one actually and uh, he had the model quite a ways done um, yeah and uh, serious mods he commented on the photo saying you know if you get I've got one made up already if you guys want to finish that and so I said yeah I will and uh, my buddy also said yeah so then we just decided that we would work on it together and so yeah um, see today's Thursday so tomorrow uh, we should hopefully be starting on that uh, Sirius said to talk to him on Friday and remind him and he should be able to get it to us then so yeah uh, so my buddy is going to work on finishing up the modeling part and he's going to do the texturing, and then I'm going to uh, throw together some decals for it, uh, which won't be too hard. Uh, just there's two decals on it on the side, and then some warning decals and stuff as well uh, that will get put on. And then I'm going to script it and in game it and stuff like that. Uh, I'm not sure if it'll be released, that's going to be up to Sirius mostly, um, as it is his model. Uh, and then I am going to, I'm also going to have him send me a copy of it, and uh, I'm going to uh, use a couple pieces off of it for my 615P, I think, uh, I don't know, I gotta look and see how close they are, uh, and see if I can use some of its parts, uh, and if I can then might borrow some parts off of it. Uh, my pickup header wouldn't be released, so it wouldn't be uh, that big of a deal. Uh, if I used parts off of other things uh, and then in the meantime I'm gonna rebake textures on uh, the uh, pickup header from uh, 13 that was converted over and uh, you know, give that a new AO and then uh, edit the uh, adjust the scripting some and uh, also adjust the model some so that it works with dirt 
and then uh, it'll be good to go again. Let's get our driver requested here. I did repair the combine and grain cart and truck. Uh, the grain cart here was the, the grain cart itself was, I think. It was a, just about 50% damaged, and the tractor itself was like 40%. And so, I had to repair that, and then figured I'd repair the combine while I was at it. I should have refuel, refueled the combine while I was at it, but we'll do that later, I guess. Slow down, my green cart. There you go. Yeah, gotta love when the course plays just completely mental. Mentally retarded. Mm. So yeah, um, this next truckload, well, just the front trailer will actually fill it. But, and then, uh, also, I hit the wrong button. Um, after harvest, we're going to be buying different trailers. Uh, we're going to be buying these dope, Doper, I think that's how you say that, uh, B-Train trailers. That's not something that you usually see in my area, but they are really well done. Uh, if you would like to get these, they are on It Isn't Working Modding on Facebook. Um, as of now, anyways, uh, he did say that he was uploading them to American Eagles Modding. So, uh, you know, check there first. Uh, and if they're not there, then go to his Facebook page. Um, it's right here it isn't working modding uh, it isn't working is all one and only the I and it is capitalized uh, so yeah um, and our green card's going to just be completely stupid Let's see if we can get there. Uh, yeah they're really awesome trailers they're very well done. Um, actually, you know what? I kind of want to just rent them right now and use them. You know what? That's what we're going to do. Let's go ahead. Let's get out of the green cart's way here. We're going to get rid of both of these trailers and we are going to get the doper trailers um, I know I do a lot of equipment changing on here but oh well I guess so I'll return that one and return that now if we go to tippers we're gonna get the lead for holy crap that's a lot of money for five days and then the pup for five days. Now it is only going to take like another day or two before uh, for harvest to end, but we will probably want it uh, to sell off some grain as well. So, and if nothing else, we'll return it early. Uh, we are 320, just about 328,000 in the red, but. Um, It'll pay off in the end. Uh, these are the trailers that we're going to buy once we can afford it anyways. So. It's just money. It can be made back later on. We can also take out a loan and pay it back. So. all of our straw still sitting there. And I think that we will actually have more capacity doing it this way. Um, 44 and 44. So that's going to be just 
about a hundred thousand there. Uh, I guess it's actually gonna be just a little less, but not much. So yeah, this is uh, it's not beta; it's version one. Uh, he does have more stuff that he's going to do to him. Uh, I'm pretty sure. So you know, like uh, I think he needs to redo his AO here on the front trailer. Uh, he's got a lot of black spots on it. But, it takes time to get a, uh, you know, fully finished awesome mod, so. Uh, mods don't happen overnight. But yeah, they are a very, very well done trailer. Uh, they have dynamic fill planes, animated gates. Uh, they have dirt textures, uh, so they are washable. Uh, and I'll show you guys. If you look here, oops, I hit the brakes too hard. If you look, there's this little rope here that's attached to the uh, can to the um, the tarp, and these I think must have a auto tarp or something. Let's look. Hmm. Can't quite tell if it has like an auto tarp or not. Anyway, let's get back to the field and uh, get this guy unloaded. There's a grain cart unloaded. Get this guy loaded. See, the only bad thing about uh, being on medium settings is I can't have um, all my lights on at once. Like with the green cart, I can only have either the front or either the rear work lights. I can't have both, um, which does suck, but uh, the game runs a whole lot smoother right now uh, this way on this map. So, I don't know, I might test it, just see what it's like if I put it on high and leave the settings. Uh, change that Sirius suggested. Um, I think I said this in Tuesday's video, I'm not sure, but I'll uh, just say it again. Uh, Sirius, uh, when he was helping me up my screenshot game, uh, it was funny, he sent me a message, he's like, let's uh, work on your screenshots a little bit. And, um, you know, that was just like kind of the general message through that. Um, you know, there was a bunch of other stuff said in it as well. But, uh, I'm not going to go through all of that. Wow. This actually has a soybean texture. Awesome. Uh, anyway, and uh, he said, you know, what's your game set on, game settings set it to? And, you know, and I told him, he said, alright, uh, put it, you know, what's your FPS? And I said, and he's like, alright, um, you know, set this to this and this to that and that kind of stuff. And, uh. <laughs> um, get rid of that and so then he I changed all that stuff and uh, game is running a whole lot better as you can see you know, when we're in the yard here uh, we're not quite as low with our frame rate uh, it is still kind of low but that's to be uh, expected plus it is night so there's a lot of lights and stuff like that running right now uh, but yeah so this field isn't running quite as well it is still running pretty good but it's not quite as well as uh, what it could be Get a nice uh, screenshot here. And then uh, I'm going to see how much time we got left. Okay, we still got 15 minutes. Uh, I'm going to quickly uh, I'm going to see if I can find
see if I can find a picture of the uh, pickup header that me and my buddy are going to work on of Sirius's. And then I'll also show you uh, my new way of editing screenshots uh, that Serious Mods uh, showed me. Uh, where the heck is this picture? Well, no, we can let the combine keep running. Um, I suppose we actually probably should sit here and wait with this. <laughs> In case our course play screws up kind of like that. Ugh, whatever. Uh, Is this not the account that I'm logged into? Oh, that's why. I see now. Here we go. So, uh, this is the pickup header uh, that Sirius started and that me and my buddy are going to finish. Uh, you can see it's just about complete. Uh, it just needs the belts, the tines the wheel mounts, the wheels, and then uh, some belts and pulleys and chains and stuff in there. Uh, and then if we go here, actually, I want to also show you guys, I um, can show you guys some stuff here. So if we go here, scroll down, and go to like this one. So this is a screenshot from before I changed my settings. Um, oh my God. Uh, this is from before I changed my settings. If it'll load. Uh, this is from before I changed my settings. Uh, and and uh, this is edited in Photoshop. And we go here. Um, this is after I changed my settings and before editing. Uh, you can see this is a whole lot nicer. And then this is after changing my settings and after editing. Come on, load for me, please. Load, 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 load. I am still using Photoshop for my watermark, and um, but yeah, so here is after editing. This is a whole lot nicer, uh, and then you can see my watermark. I'm changing that from rather than having it in the center and being very, very, you know, noticeable. I have it so that it's kind of off in a corner, you know, a little less noticeable. It's still there, but it's not like, you know, hey, I'm right here. Look at me kind of thing. Uh, so this is the website. It's ribbit, R-I-B-B-E-T dot com. So if we go to my screenshots folder. All right, so I, this is what I do. I go auto fix, exposure. Uh, I go highlights, 
15, shadows, 15, contrast, 10. Apply. Or wait, no. Undo. Exposure, I do auto exposure. There we go. And then colors, sometimes I'll do auto colors, and sometimes I will not. Like there, it's uh, not very nice. So I'll go 10 there. And 0 there. Uh, and then we'll go 15 with our sharpness. And 15 with clarity. Ooh, maybe not. Maybe I'll bring that down. There we go. Apply. And now we go and save. Save it as a PNG. Save. Save. And replace. And then I just open it in Photoshop and... Um, and uh, add my watermark and that kind of stuff. So we're on our third headland now, which is good. So yeah, um, the next video that I do, uh, I don't know. I'm either going to do... We'll see where we're at. Uh, the next video will probably be harvesting on field 15 or else field 16. Uh, it depends on how much time I'm sp I spend uh, playing here. Uh, my goal today is get this thing uploaded and then I'm going to go outside and uh, do some major work on my bike. Uh, I've been kind of slacking on that the last few days. So uh, I've been working on my bike. I'm stripping all the paint off of it and completely repainting it, painting it new, getting the rust off of it, getting it clear coated and all that good stuff. And uh, I've been buying a lot of new parts for it as well. Uh, it's really, I should have just as well bought a new bike for as much as I put into this project, but whatever, it's a fun little project to do. I like tearing stuff apart, working on it, putting it back together. Um, so, yeah, so my goal is, uh, get this video finished recording. It's 11.50 right now, uh, so I got five hours, which is going to be plenty of time. Uh, once I finish recording, I'm going to get this thing popped into the editor get it edited and then get it started on saving and then while it's saving I'm gonna go uh, get something to eat and probably s get all my stuff together to work on the bike and it should be done editing by then and then I will uh, get started on uploading and go outside and get some work done uh, and then I'm also going to um, over the next few days but you know I'm, I won't have to work on the pickup header here for a few days uh, because it's gonna take uh, my buddy said middle of next week he should be done that's his goal so I won't have to worry about that in the meantime I'm going to um, finish up my Chevy C30 uh, I need to put it back in blender and uh, redo some stuff I need to redo the interior and adjust some faces on it uh, in different places and then uh, I'll have to end up rebaking it uh, maybe uh, it depends on how much of a change there is uh, between the old uh, AO and uh, the new AO. Uh, if they line up exactly the same, I won't have to rebake anything. Uh, but if they line up differently, I'll have to rebake everything. Um, so yeah, and then uh, I also want to um, finish up. Uh, I don't have to do the water trailer anymore because. Uh, it's already been done by Steen Camp Modding. Uh, it is right here, the Dura Hall trailer. So I don't have to do that. Um, let's see what else I got in here. So we got the uh, Chevy. This truck I'm not doing. I can delete that. Uh, here we got that. That. Um, see, I can delete that. Uh, here we got my dual lift trailer. I'm going to also get that completed uh, and finish up that first video series for that. 
I'm going to probably also get started on this uh, bush, uh, the mower here. And then we've got a bunch of other stuff here as well. Um, I have this Alice Chalmers pack here uh, that is from 13 that a uh, buddy of mine converted over. And so I'm going to be redoing AOs on this stuff. Uh, it is working in 15. I'm just going to redo the AO textures and then set it up for dirt as well. Uh, I'm not going to do all of this stuff, you know, like this little plow here. Uh, this I'm not going to do. Uh, this plow I'm not going to do. There's some different stuff that I'm not going to do in it. And then there is also another thing. Uh, there's a gleaner combine in that pack that's in 13 that they didn't convert over that I am going to convert over. So convert over and redo the textures on that as well. Uh, just going to try and get as much uh, old iron stuff put together as I can uh, for my um, for starting equipment on my map once it's finished. Uh, I do, I need to figure out doors um, badly. You know, I am going to just move on to the next building, but I really badly want to figure out doors uh, so I can get that done as well, but... I'm not worried about it right now. Uh, I do need to get working on the map um, as well, finish putting in power lines, get all the other details added in. Uh, there's been a lot of awesome shops coming out, or buildings in general, on American Eagles Modding by, uh, I think it's CBJ Modding. Uh, those guys do some awesome work. Uh, they've been putting out some pretty, pretty sweet buildings uh, lately. Uh, they got a bunch of shops, they got, uh, just today, they re or last night, something like that, they put out a, a silage bunker, and they've got cattle buildings, all sorts of stuff, a bunch of awesome buildings, so go check those out. Uh, also, che also check them out on Facebook, uh, CBJ Modding, uh, those guys are really awesome, uh, they do some awesome work, and fun guys to talk to, um, you know, I've just talked to them in comments on um, some of their posts and they seem like really awesome people so uh, definitely go check them out and uh, if you're a uh, map builder or map editor and looking for some good buildings they're definitely the people to go check out uh, they've got all sorts of cool buildings all different shapes and sizes and uh, they're also open to suggestions so if you got a building that you would like to see uh, you suggest it to them and they'll do the best that they can uh, which their best that they can is usually pretty awesome so uh, yeah so definitely go give them a look see see what you think of their stuff so yeah, we're getting very very close to being done with harvest uh, we just got two fields of beans left and then the corn so another couple weeks uh let's see we got saturday tuesday and possibly thursday on the soybeans so we got two or three days on that and then we got two to four days on that so another two weeks or so uh of harvest uh if i do that I might yeah I might uh, also start uploading some other videos uh, in between like I might upload some videos of some mod work uh, you know like on my map on some of these projects that I'm working on some of that kind of stuff uh, you know I might start adding in other games as well uh, which is what I think I might do uh, tomorrow's Friday what I might do is I might record a Beam and G Drive video um, because that was one of the videos that, or one of the games that uh, people wanted to see. Uh, Beam and G Drive, American Truck Sim, and Construction Sim are the ones that we will be doing. Those are the most requested um, games. So we'll be adding those in. I don't know when. Uh, I'm going to. Revise the channel schedule and uh, also edit my links that are in the description. Uh, minimize the channels and then also add in 
uh, some Facebook pages that are awesome to check out, add in some different YouTube channels, stuff like that. So, um, how much time we got left? Uh, we will end that then. So yeah, guys, that's going to do it for me in this video. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. Make sure to subscribe if you like what you see. Uh, hit the or Make sure to turn on my post notifications to be notified every time I upload a new video. My video schedule is Tuesdays and Thursdays at 4 p.m. Central, Saturdays at noon Central. Uh, as I've said many times, that will be changing very soon as we incorporate new games into the channel. Um, make sure you check out down below in the description for links to all my social medias, my mod site, where you can get... Uh, my fuel trailer and many other mods that I have made and any other future mods that I make that I make for release I should specify that uh, just uh, make sure you know that uh, just so you know you do need to make an account to uh, have access to everything other than the updates and site rules um, sections so yeah um, Make sure you check out the uh, other cool YouTube channels that are linked down there below. Uh, they are worth taking a look at. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. For